Welcome back to Paddy's Golf Tips 2023 version. We're here at Ritz Carlton Grand Lakes uh, in Orlando at the PNC Championship and we're going to record a few golf tips that hopefully will change your mind about the way you think about golf. Uh, and the very first tip is going to be up, down, up. How not to top the ball. The winner of the gold medal and the champion golfer of the year is Podrick Harrington. <laughs> Why do amateurs, especially new beginners, top the golf ball? Okay, this also applies to hitting the golf ball a long way, but it's mainly the reason why amateurs top the golf ball. So, new golfers, they come to golf and you know, they've played other sports and they, they, most people will have a reasonable idea how to swing a stick. So when they go to hit a golf ball the first time, they understand that to get some speed, they've got to accelerate up. So they nicely push up off the ground and of course they go and they push up off the ground and they have a bit of a top, a fall back. I'll show you that again. Usually they actually hit the ground beforehand. So they accelerate up and they get this sort of topping motion. So what's actually happening there? Believe it or not, the movement is correct. It's just mistimed when they're doing the movement. So when you swing a golf club, you're meant to generally keep your head reasonably level in the backswing. We don't mind if it goes up a little and over here a bit. When you start your downswing, you're meant to move down a bit and then you explode up. Whereas the beginner only, he's so keen to keep his head down here. She is so keen to keep their head down. They keep their head and it actually drops. And then when they start their downswing, the only place to go from here is up, causing that drop in here like so, I can't even get that top. Hang on a second, I get a nice fresh air. So if I go up early, as you can see, and if I try and help it in the air, I go fresh air, which happens a lot to beginners. So what do you want to do? I would say experiment, first of all, with going up in the backswing. We want to stay level, but I don't mind if you go up. So if you go up, you're gonna to have to come down. So as long as we come down as we start our downswing, that delays the up. So the up is now going to be here, rather than if we came straight up, it would be back here. So all we're really trying to do is delay the explosion up to the golf ball, okay? We do that by making sure we start our downswing by going down. And for amateurs or beginners, the best way maybe to get that down motion early on in their swing is to go up in the backswing. So, a long hitter will go up in the backswing. That's what they tend to do. The, the long drive guys will do everything they can to get up so they get down and then back up through impact. So the key here is up, down, up, or at least level, you must go down to start your downswing. There is no other way. If you want to create speed, you must have a little down and then the up, okay? It delays where the up is so that the up is further down your golf swing and further over to the ball. The last thing we want is an early up. If we get an early up, we're gonna get that fresh air or top. So again, we do want the up. Do not get away from that. The keys here is do not keep your head down in the backswing. Your head in the backswing will rotate a little. It will shift a little at times. Plenty of good golfers have done that. It can rise a little. Certainly your chest rises. We're not too worried about the head rising. The head usually stays level. We start our downswing by down. You can do this by pressing into your left heel, like so, squatting down, pushing down. And then as we're coming into impact, we explode up. Now the explode up is the left side gets long, real long, a real big stretch in the left side. You're kind of pulling in on the brakes here but the right side actually stays down, okay? So this doesn't come up with it. It's not both shoulders coming up, it's the left coming up and the right is staying side bend, bent down like so. If you look at this down the angle, you can see that this is coming up, this is staying down. So the, you're trying to get the longest possible angle from your left foot to your left shoulder, like so. 
with the right side staying down under, but it must be later in the golf swing. So you've got to go up, down, up, and that will push that move further down. So for a raw beginner, you probably have the up. I think everybody, when they start off in the game, has a bit of that up, which is a good thing. For the raw beginner, definitely allow themselves to feel like they're up. You can keep an eye on the golf ball. I'm not telling you, to, I'm just telling you not to keep your head still, I'm telling you not to keep your head down. You can definitely keep an eye on the ball, up, down, and back up. So if you go up, I guarantee you, if you go up in the backswing, the only thing you will do on the downswing, you will have to come down. While if you stay down in the backswing, you'll have the big tendency to come up and have nothing in it. That no move at all, okay? So very important, if you don't want to top the golf ball, do not keep your head down, do not keep your head still. Make sure you have a bit of movement up, get yourself down, and then allow yourself to explode up into the golf ball. So I'm gonna do that in a, in a nice, full-on fashion. You will see the move. So I'd be pretty level, plant and up. Okay. Now, what would be interesting to see if somebody slows this down in slow motion. So when I go up, I go down. At impact, I look like I'm still down, but I'm actually going up. It's true impact I'm going up to the end of my swing. So a lot of times if you stop a golf swing in a static position, it doesn't show, the static position doesn't show the dynamic move. So as I'm, I am going, feeling like I'm going up, it will look to all intents and purposes that I, my head won't be up at that stage, but I am exploding up through impact. And that's very important to note that. So what you're feeling like you're doing in the golf swing, it ha the feel happens before you see it turn up in the golf swing. That would be the best way. So if I feel like I'm going up through impact, it won't show up in a, in a, in a static picture, but I am very much going, exploding up through that ball to get speed. So up, down, up is the best way not to top a ball. Do not go down in the backswing because you have nowhere to go. So do not keep your head still, which always leads to a drop. Make sure up, down, up, if you don't want to top the ball. And it's also good for speed. <laughs> 